Hello and welcome to Theme Park Information. In today's show we've got a review for Shivering Timbers located at Michigan's Adventure in Michigan. Pretty simple that one. Uh, this is a massive wooden roller coaster, one of the longest in the world. And I will be honest, I actually think this is a completely hidden gem between all the roller coasters out there. Now I'm not going to lie to you, this isn't the world's smoothest roller coaster. It's not ridiculously rough, but it kind of falls somewhere in the tree and it has that kind of classic wooden roller coaster feel to it. It has I don't know how many airtime hills because there's so many of them. It's you know, for like 12, 13 or something like that. It's just such a simple but brilliant layout. Uh, now I have went on it in 2019 so it didn't have like a kind of tip track bit. Uh, so I can't comment on how cool that was. Uh, it's just one of those rides where thankfully my friend managed to persuade me to go to uh, Michigan's Adventure and this was one of the main reasons and this probably made the entire trip worth it to that particular park uh, but yeah uh, it's just got a very simple but good layout it's fun uh, had pretty decent operations running two trains have so been dispatched pretty quickly uh, it doesn't have any theme it has a really good name if it, you know, I think uh, and I will be honest it it's a bit of a shame this ride isn't more widely recognised or particularly known about because it is such fun. Uh, it just ticks all the boxes. It's, you know, just got this, you know, just really simplistic but fun layout. It utilises the airtime. It actually looks massive as well. Like, I would think of this ride would be like 150 foot. It's like only, you know, about 100 or so. It's really strange. You, it looks really imposing. It has a good drop. Uh, it's not, there's no particularly rough section of it. And it's a massive, you know, plus point for Michigan's Adventure Park, which in fairness is in desperate need of any other plus point out there. Uh, so, generally speaking, you, I do appreciate it's not a destination park or a destination ride, but so happy I went on it. As for score, uh, it's uh, really difficult to judge it. Uh, partly because I think this is one of the most underrated rides in the country, so I don't want to try to jump above how good I feel it is on that basis. Uh, but I reckon somewhere around 85, I would say, would be a very fair reflection of the ride. I mean, I'll put it to you this way, it's not as good uh, as like Al Toro or The Voyage or anything like that, but it's right up there. It's a really good, fun, enjoyable ride, and hopefully uh, you guys will like, comment and subscribe, and let me know what you think about it, uh, and I'll catch you guys on the next one.